My name is Marcia and I'm 75 years old. I grew up in a Republican family and have voted Republican my entire life until 2016 when I voted for Hillary Clinton. From the time I listened to and read about Donald Trump as he began his presidential run, I knew I could never vote for this man. As his presidency began, I thought I knew how terrible it would be having a narcissistic, dishonest, incompetent bully in the White House is not a good idea. But Trump far surpassed my worst expectations. He is a danger to our Constitution and a man who cares only about himself and advancing his personal goals at the expense of the American people. He tries to divide us instead of uniting us and creates chaos every time he opens his mouth, spewing lies and verbally attacking anyone in his way although he does have trouble creating a complex sentence. His slow response to the pandemic was surpassed only by his deranged talk of disinfectants and light being used as cures. Instead of speaking calmly to all of us about the tragic death of George Floyd and the civil unrest that followed, he threatens to send vicious dogs and the military after the thugs, as he calls them. As we watch him denigrate the office of president with his lies and crazy rants, Republican lawmakers say and do nothing. They are cowards and sycophants who do not deserve to be in public office anymore. My hope is that people of all parties are tired of the chaos, deceit, bad behavior, and unrest, and decide that Trump must go. I am no longer a Republican and I will happily vote for Joe Biden, a decent man who will restore dignity and honesty to the White House. I will also vote for all down-ballot Democrats in November, and November 3rd cannot come soon enough. Thank you.